What Ray gives that? Yo, P. Ray in here, bro. We gonna spin the block on them niggas. It's Ray Gift TV. Okay, so check it out. WAC 100 reacts to Rainwater telling on Yellow Beezy live in the courtroom. What? Let's get right to it. It's Ray Gift TV. Spin the block. What's up with these Dallas niggas, Brock? You know, at the end of the day, my nigga. <laughs> you know, these Texas niggas, at the end of the day, Brock. It's Texas shit, my nigga, like you being here pushing that Texas shit, like Texas handling in Texas, you know what I'm saying? Like Texas you niggas got the motherfucking Texas. spurs on the back of your Air Forces, nigga. Jumping out the motherfucking whips, nigga. Like it's real horsepower. And now niggas is all in the motherfucking courtroom, my nigga. What's going on in Texas, nigga? I thought you was the mayor of Texas, nigga. 45, 10, 6, 10, 287, Spur 291. Nigga, what's going on, my nigga? 290, yeah, all that. But look, um, nah, I ain't gonna lie. You know Rainwater is civilian, so this is he's doing his job. No, that no, nigga. listen. No, listen. That, I, I hate to say it. It's not funny. But because we know Rainwater, yes, hearing that nigga up there talk, man, I was scared. Yeah, I was just scared. I, no, we I'm expected like, it. We hear yeah, him. Yeah, that's what I was listen. saying. Whack. The nigga say he's not a street nigga. He he's done said that to... shit multiple times. Listen. So the lawyer. So you see the lawyer trying to play him like he a street nigga and trying to like trying to play that him ain't gonna, like. That ain't so you happen. run away from he people. Said, yeah, he yep. said, yeah, man, I I don't deal with rappers. Yeah, my artists they R and B man. In country, in country. country. <laughs> hey, Wack, but look, we were trying to figure out why would the lawyer say, but they're streaming on YouTube. I think that he put it out there because he, he he thought that Rainwater might have been like, damn, everybody's listening in or some shit like that because she had said First something. First of all, who you think sent me the link, nigga? Rainwater. <laughs> right, right, right. Oh. oh. Right, this nigga, you feel me? So this this is funny as hell. He's playing it. Hey, Yellow Beezy's lawyer is trash, okay? He is trash. Be real, though, the Yellow Beezy ain't get a nigga much to defend. Like, I mean, that nigga, that, that shit is, is, is damn near open and shit, bro. Like, he, that nigga, and he be on the, he was on the internet saying all kind of shit, bro. That nigga, that shit. Well, his lawyer was trying to, trying to just take it off of Yellow Beezy, but... The fact that he caught him and then, you know, he was like, well, could it have been a point when the other guy, um, you know what I mean, put you down or hit you or whatever. So the lawyer was that just trying to, to, his, uh, trying his to take the damage off of him. But it was, uh -huh. you know, it's on video. I guess Yellow V, I haven't seen a video, but Yellow Beezy must have been the one to hawk his ass down, you know, to yeah, the point where everything else Ryan could happen. He got his ass beat up out there at that club, but he, uh... I mean, everybody knew Rainwater was gonna sue. He said it, and then, but the thing is, the thing now, this is an angle that I was wondering if they was gonna bring up. Rainwater was running around saying he wanted to fight the nigga afterwards, and he wanted to fight. He wanted to fight, and that they could settle it outside if they just fought. It wouldn't be no loss. I wonder if he was gonna go that angle, but they probably ain't even do. They just do all the way. This lawyer don't seem like he got anything. tripped up because he said, yeah. "Oh, so you haven't been active on social media? You know what I mean?" As far as certain things so he could have went with that but he, he he was getting tripped up she was like yo if you get do a better job trying to call in and maybe you know pretty much he was trying to say you're so scared why don't you first though if you know I guess to let you up in the plane up there yeah, and he trying to say, like, you know, I want the celebrity fight. I want this, that, and the third, da, da, da. Now, that ain't going to just fully exonerate no yellow beezy, but I'm just saying. But a celebrity of... fight is controlled. This was something that was out of his control. Well, so, well, if he wanted to monetize. In a, in a way. Well, but hold on, hold on. Hold on. He paying. And in a way that he's, uh, he's saying he's a victim. So, if you're a victim and you're scared and you're in fearful of your life and you're fearing for your life, you don't usually call out a, a boxing match from the person that you're in fear for of your life. You see what I'm right. saying? Right. So, that's, I'm just saying, I'm not saying it's going to get a nigga Why is lawyer then? That's crazy. Yeah, I'm not going to say it's going to get a nigga out, but it's like, it kind of can help to the jury show that he's not just this ultimate sweet manager whose whole life right has now. changed since this incident yeah right, right, <laughs> right now that's what it looks like and that, right. he's done a great job of being a victim ebony he's playing his job he's gonna go get his money um and once he gets that money he's gonna be an asshole on social media talking about how he finessed the shit out of that nigga and now he has to pay him 
He's gonna hey, Brock, bite. he said, have you ever ran before? He said, yep. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I can't remember exactly when, yes. but I've ran before. Yes, from several rappers. Uh, anytime it's a problem, I'm going to run. And that, he said that the nigga, lyrics, just hearing the lyrics and the, the representation. He said he felt it in his body, Ebony. <laughs> Ebony, he said he felt it in his body. He said, what made you feel it in your body? He said, I don't know, man. It's just I just felt it in my body. It was time to run when I saw him charging at me. Like but said, he didn't bring up I, any gun when the when they were, you know, the uh, defense was uh, examining him. But when his lawyer came, his lawyer, you know, was like, well, what happened before when he came with a group of people before with him? He just said it was Yellow Beasley that charged type shit. So, you know, his lawyer got some some good shit up out of him, I guess. But this shit funny. It's going to be good. It's going to be a good little funny case. I thought that was Diddy in them case. At first. I was like, how the fuck did Rainwater get involved in Diddy shit? Then I was like, this, and I was like, oh, okay, oh, okay. I was like, god damn, but it's Diddy, Diddy, go deep. I'm like, this. Were there but, uh, any criminal like charges filed, or is this, this is just a civil? So I know this one. I think is when like it first civil. happened, it was criminal, but yeah, this is all civil right here. This is just civil right here. I don't know if it's ain't nothing criminal depending on. Because you said something about why you didn't call the police or whatever the case may be. So I didn't know if it ever went criminal. Right, but again, he's a victim. He don't really have to do that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that is a good point, but you don't really have to. You don't have no obligation to. Especially when you're in fear of your life. Yeah, especially yeah, especially you know you're gonna see them. He could just say, you know, I felt intimidated, and he can use the Cassie. You know what I'm saying? So I felt intimidated. I feel I couldn't couldn't say nothing. If I did, my life would have been in danger. That nigga finna it's get a check, bro. It's the voice that nigga's using for me. <laughs> like, he finna that get a he about to get a check, bro. And BZ could have yeah. fought that nigga. He could have just got the fight out the way. They tried to line it up the way. He could have got the fight out the way. Put some in that motherfucker contract. And civils and shit. And just try to... And hopefully, you know, that would have held up type shit. You know what I mean? But... Mm-hmm. Damn, I'm just like, okay. Like, light-skinned niggas. <laughs> like... I nigga just sued yeah, him too. This a the streets. Bit. We in a whole nother world in the street shit, right? Nigga will sue your ass. <laughs> Yo. Nigga will sue your ass, nigga. Nigga took it to He right there in court, just like <laughs> As a matter of fact, that's what that nigga did to the game. That's what that nigga did to the game. Um what's that nigga name out there uh, from the West Coast? And they got his ass beat up. Game had to Talk about forty tomorrow. Glock, bro. Beat that nigga up. Yeah, forty Glock, nigga. Forty wops. Hit that his nigga ass. got on that the stand like that too? Bro, yeah, that nigga 40 Glock said he couldn't have sex no more. He said all kind of shit. That nigga was on the stand telling. And, and I, I, I don't know. I don't know if he ended up getting like a default judgment or something because gang didn't go or something. I don't know. I got to ask Wack what happened with that situation. But yeah, man, that's what these niggas would do. Wait, was that what Ack was talking about? Something Which one? About, something about a, a civil suit with game and something. Had to be if it was if he was referencing this case because that that was very similar. But I'm sure bro didn't face the hell of civil suits. You know how this shit go. Niggas, you get you some bags, bro. You gonna get it. Shit, you know how many niggas finna try to come back and sue you for kicking them niggas uh Ebony after you get your ticket? Nigga, you finna have, sign you, some shit, nigga. My yeah, shit is you better, signed. Yeah, I'm niggas gonna say I felt intimidated. <laughs> Waivers are signed. Contracts are signed. I felt intimidated. Signed, I signed. Felt intimidated. <laughs> she know how to fight. I thought she was gonna kill me. I have me. all of our correspondence. I just signed the paper. <laughs> I didn't. I had no choice but to sign this fucking paper. Hey, don't get nobody no goddamn ideas. Man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to put you in the mindset of a man right now. It's dangerous right here, fuzz. Nah, I get it. I get it. I totally get it. I want you to it. feel it. I want you to feel it though. I want you to understand what the fuck we say, Ebony. Like a nigga can't nigga gonna wake up and want some kids one day. <laughs> Do y'all not know that we can't go fuck the hoes no more, fellas? Like, that shit over with. The run is over. It's over. It's over. Because everybody's Remember? looking at it as a bag. You know, you don't know who's, what their bro, motive is I mean, behind shit, the shit. Bro, bitch sue me, she ain't gonna get nothing. Because nigga, yeah, shit, I ain't, you be wasting your time, oh. But look, if you do get you some chili, you feel me? They gonna come, they gonna come for it, bro. You can't fuck the calls, fellas. You remember how the dream was to get rich and fuck all the bitches? That, that's, yeah, that, that's over. The broken.
Yeah, you know, these hoes ain't gonna have no choice but to fuck with us. Salute to the room. These hoes ain't gonna have no choice but to fuck with us. Salute, hey, the broke niggas better take heed too, cause uh, this nigga wanted to tell him, hey, you ever hit the lottery one day? Did this nigga just come in the room and say hi, everyone? Please acknowledge me and say hi back. No, no one said that. You nappy head fool. <laughs> you nappy head fool. <laughs> yeah, go put your go put your uh, your dentures in, nigga. You you're slurring your words. Sound like Dame Dash right now. Uh, but anyways, uh, back to the uh, topic before Cool Breeze came. His ass Go out put your one. glasses on so you can Cool Breeze, read out. the room. Cool Breeze, read the room. Look around and read the room. All right. Um, <laughs> he can't read. That was the funny part. Uh, but anyways, um, shout out my nigga Cool Breeze. Definitely playing his card right now. <laughs> funny. Braille the room, Cool Breeze. Braille the room. You ain't, you ain't, you ain't no, the room you ain't no comedian, nigga. the room out. Braille the room, bro. Yeah. Braille the room open and, that, and, and open understand that right what's going on. So you can see the whole room. Braille, braille the room. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This payback from the other day, bitch. I remember that, that shit. That's all right, nigga. ho. That's yeah, all right, know. ho. You right. <laughs> that's my nigga, bro. You right. Oh, puss ass nigga. I always talking to this motherfucker about it. Wait, he trying to say you got lazy eye, bro? What do you mean open? <laughs> no, me, uh, me and Cool Breeze got some beef right there, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you. That nigga, we go. I'm gonna squabble his ass. I'm gonna put on the blindfold so that shit be a fucking fair fight, but I'm gonna beat his ass. Okay, that's, that's, that's what the miles say, bitch. I've been blind yeah. too long, nigga. Y'all, you think you can whoop me in a blind fight, nigga? Damn right. Hey, Tame. I know cool I breeze. can. What the fuck? <laughs> I know I can. <laughs> <laughs> in a blind Please, fight, they got a I whole. He done been on me. mute, taking all this shit in. Now this nigga popping shit. He said a blind shit. fight, you can't beat me. He said this nigga want to step in my realm. He said this nigga want to step. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about the content. I appreciate the support. Everybody tuning in to the platform. You feel me? Rainwater, Yellow Beezy. What is going down? They really beefing right now, man. That's crazy. I mean, like. Or ain't water in court, he telling it all. Wow. Man, y'all like the video, share the video, and please subscribe to the platform. We running the numbers up over here. You feel me? And everybody out there grinding and grinding, remember, hard work will pay off. You gotta do what you gotta do to make it happen for you and yours. And there it go. Wake up, eat your weedies, get to it. Don't waste no time. No lacking. Remember, hard work will pay off, man. You gotta believe that, for real. Shout out to SJ, got the juice TV. My dog, Clubhouse TV, Getty Radio, the answer. Black Savage, no capping, cash rules. Everybody out there, content create, man. Let's run it up, you feel me? But until next time, it's your boy Ray Gibbon, I'm gone. God bless, peace.